It's been 50 years since the Vietnam War, and today the Oscar G. Johnson VA Medical Center in Iron Mountain held a ceremony honoring Vietnam War veterans. TV6's Iron Mountain Kingster Bureau reporter Monique Lopez gives us an up-close look at today's event. Vietnam veterans were all presented with Vietnam War commemoration pins at the event. Displays of Vietnam War timelines, maps, and memorabilia ignited memories of a war and time all veterans their share. Good memories of the guys you were with that I can remember. A lot of it I don't remember anymore. But the guys I served with, they're all, all good guys. Because when you're there, you have to depend on everybody. So you get to know everybody, you get to be friends. Brotherhood, yeah, definitely. Vietnam veteran and featured speaker Joe Stevens also stood before his fellow comrades to remember the war they all bravely fought in. Go home, we'll talk about it, move on with your life. I don't have to tell you guys that because you know all about that. Memories of returning home from a war to a nation during a contentious time in history is still a sore spot for a lot of these veterans. What we did, you know, welcome home that we didn't get. You know, when I came home, when I went back to work, I'd, I don't remember any, anybody even asking me about Vietnam. And, you know, you think about that. You think about, you know, why didn't anybody ask about it? And, or, you know, it has, uh, holds feelings. There's no doubt about that. The commemoration events that took place were to thank and honor Vietnam War vets and their families. For many of the veterans who served in that era, this recognition by their community has been a long time coming. It's a start. I mean, there's been Vietnam parades in the past, there's been welcome home parades, and there's been a lot going on. But for the government to welcome the Vietnam vets for 50 years is, I think it's a start. I think it's something that uh, is, maybe I shouldn't say this, but a little bit overdue. And although we could never really take back the treatment of the veterans as they returned in that era, this is definitely one step in the right direction. Monique Lopez, TV6 News, Iron Mountain.